So this is an intensive five-week foundational quantitative skills course for economic historians. It's compulsory for all our BSc in Economic History students, and what it does is provide you with the foundational quantitative skills that are going to be necessary for you to get through your second year quantitative project and your third year dissertation. It's also going to give you the tools you need to understand the statistics and numerical methods that the authors of the stuff you're reading uh, are using, right? So an EH 101, an EH 102, you'll be reading all of these papers with different quantitative methods, and this course that we do alongside those allows you to understand what these economic historians are actually doing in their own work. So the course will start off with some baseline statistics, but then also we'll get into how to manage and, and work with data, how to read graphs properly, and how to visualize data and you know, make graphs yourself that are easy, easy to read. So in the lectures what we do is work with some foundational statistical concepts, right? Descriptive statistics, inferential statistics, probabilities, and how economic historians use these principles. And then we illustrate these with real-world examples. So you might be familiar with how statistics come up in newspapers and magazines and things like that, and we're going to use those kind of modern, Freakonomics-style, real-world examples to illustrate these concepts. You know, not very many equations, more real-world content. And then what we're going to do with those skills that you learn is translate it into essentially doing your own research. So in this course, you know, which starts at the beginning of your degree, we're going to be doing quantitative research essentially from day one. We're going to work collaboratively with a single data set throughout the five weeks, and you're going to start conducting your own quantitative research into this material. Okay, so what this course gives you is a kind of statistical or numerical literacy that you're going to need for your degree at LSE. But beyond that, it gives you the skills you need to interpret stats and figures that you're going to be working with probably, you know, for the rest of your, rest of your lives. So we have some real world applications for the quantitative tools we're teaching you. And we also have, you know, data management skills built into the course. So working with databases, working with statistical tools that are real world skills that are valuable to employers, these are the other things that this course reinforces.